So this news and this development in the case is obviously of great concern. The FBI revealed that this person of interest in the abduction of a six-year-old Cleveland girl on May 21st has now been connected to an attempted abduction of a 10-year-old Illyria girl on February 25th. Tried to gain entry through a bedroom window. Elyria Police Chief Dwayne Whiteley confirmed his case and the case here on West 104th in Cleveland were connected through forensic evidence. The FBI made it clear investigators in three jurisdictions are now expanding the search radius for this person of interest. So we need folks to think beyond Cleveland, the west side, the east side, and think beyond, think outside into Lorraine County, uh, into Summit County, uh, wherever the case may be, we just don't know. Cleveland residents and the FBI were quick to point out the distinctive walk of this man caught on neighborhood surveillance video a week before the Cleveland six-year-old was taken. The girl returned 17 hours later unharmed. With the furry thing on it, and he like, down like this. The person of interest described as 5'10", a hoodie, hat, or visor, a logo on the hoodie, and dark shoes with light-colored soles. The car possibly involved a gray 2003 to 2005 Pontiac Grand Am, sunroof, spoiler, black mirrors. Police say the six-year-old explained her abductor took her to a room that had wallpaper which depicted moose, grass, and trees on all four walls. There's nothing more important, obviously, than protecting our children and taking predators such as this individual off the street.